What's up guys, Nick here with a brand new unboxing video. This is take two because the first one I was interrupted and I had to stop. Thankfully I didn't unbox it. But this time, this is an item that I've been wanting to get for the longest time now, ever since probably a year or two ago. Now, I could, I've had plenty of chances to get it, but I was like, you know, I don't know anything about these things. And, you know, I was slowly learning for a while. And yes, I'm wearing a Mario shirt. But uh, this item is... The Elgato Game Capture HD 60. Now, what, what's the 64? It shoots 60 frames per second. So I'll be able to record anything that has 60 frames easily and then be able to upload it that way, which I'm, I probably won't. I'll probably do up to 720. That way, I, my computer doesn't have to work like six times harder or however much harder. But Okay. Next generation gameplay sharing. Yes, and I can also stream with this thing. Now, I don't know if this is the best stream in the, streaming in the world, but I'll tr I'll try it out maybe. If it works out well, I'll do I'll do some streams like once a week or something. I don't know. Next generation quality. Stunning 1080p quality with 60 frames per second. Advanced H.264 hardware encoding, which I don't know what the, that means. Lag-free HDMI pass through to the TV. So basically when I'm when I'm going to be doing recordings and stuff with this, I'm going to be facing this way. So you will see me looking here. Unless I decide to not have the camera, then you, you won't have to worry about it. Because I'm going to be facing right here, looking this way, instead of looking directly at y'all. So, let me know if y'all like that or not. I don't. Next generation control. Unlimited capture right to your PC or Mac. Flashback recording. Record retroactively. Meaning, if I miss something, I can go backwards and show it. I'm probably not going to use that. Immediate access and built-in editor, which, as far as I know, the editor is basically the video itself and not anything extra. Now, if I can add in my intros and stuff, that'd be great. And there's a kitty kitty right there. He paused. <laughs> He's like... <laughs> Next generation streaming. Built-in live stream to Twitch and YouTube, which is something I will definitely try out. Down. There we go. No, no. He doesn't listen either. Stream command. Add webcam and overlays. Built-in live commentary feature. Which you can use for your recordings also, clearly. Technical specs. Which, this is something I have to do because this is everything I need to know. Technical specs. The interface. USB 2.0. Which, I think my computer is a 2.0 or 3.0. I don't know. Input, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and 360, which, for some reason, it doesn't work for PS3, but I think there's an update to fix it. He's all over the place. Output, HDMI, pass-through, which is, go through one, comes out the other, clearly. Sorry, I'm sniffling a lot. Uh, I don't know why. Supported resolutions, 1080p 60, 1080p 30, 1080i, 720p 60, 720p 30, 576p, 576i, 480p. So, it doesn't go any lower, which I'm fine with. I don't care. All the videos I've done are basically 480s anyway. So, Dimensions. This is dimension of the device itself. 112 by 75 by 19 millimeters. This device is a little small. In inches, that is 4.4 .4 by 3 by 0.75. It weighs 3.7 ounces. This thing is, this box is probably heavier than the item itself. System requirements for PC, Windows 7, SP1, or later, meaning if you got Windows 7, it's going to work. So. For Mac, OS X 10.3 or later, second generation Intel Core i5 CPU, which I don't know what my computer is, but as far as I know, my computer is strong enough to handle it. Streaming, second generation Intel Core's i7 CPU. You need at least 4 gigabytes of RAM built in USB 2.0, which mine's a 8.0, so my computer can handle it. And you need an internet connection. Internet connection basically for, you know, to be able to put everything up or stream. Alright, that is everything about the outside of this box. Now it's time to open it. I'm actually downloading a game right now so uh i might 
not might not be doing streams like tonight. If you're you're probably more watching this dude than me. And my other cat's in here too. She's just off in the corner, just laying down. He's just he's all over the place whenever you shut him up. Yeah. <laughs> he's just looking at me like Okay. It opens up like a little tiny box thing. So it has a... Your skills immortalized. Yeah, so it shows like different kind of videos and stuff. Here's the device itself. Oh my god. This is the device itself. It is little. It is smaller. It is literally smaller than my hand. It, it can fit in your pocket. Here is, I believe this is, yeah, this is what goes inside. This is what goes out. So basically, you plug in your gaming console and stuff right there onto this side and plug that part up to your computer. This is for like a microphone, but you can use a microphone plugged up to your computer. This one is what's going to go out. So that will go out to your TV if you want to have it on your TV. You don't have to, but it's there. So that's what that's what concerned me about this a little bit. It is little. It is a little tiny thing, but it can do all this. What it's saying, you can do 1080p and all that kind of, st all that kind of stuff. All right, and then you got what is this? Oh, uh, oh shoot! What is this? Oh, this the uh, USB. Okay. I was concerned. I'm like, oh my god, did it come with an HDMI cord? Uh, the guy told us it didn't. All right. Yes, it does. It comes with an HDMI cord, and I bought an extra one. Oh, well, all right. So this is what goes inside the back of it. This one goes inside of your computer. Simple enough. And then it does come with HDMI, an HDMI cable, which I hate that I end up buying another one. I only paid ten bucks for it. So it comes with an HDMI cord. So if you have a console that already has an HDMI, you don't have to worry about another cord. I think that's all of it, isn't it? Yep. And it's just some little... Elgar Elgado. Is this a sticker? It's a sticker! They give me a sticker! <laughs> I might put it on top of the streaming thing. It's like, this is what it is. But, thank you all for watching this unboxing video. It's a little bit longer than usual. I'm going to try my best to learn this as much as possible to start giving you all some high-quality videos of whatever I can because the last thing I want to do is start losing viewers because you know I'm not I'm not up to par you know so it's like what do I got to do I want to do this I want to be able to give you all some better quality videos to where I'm not streaming them to my computer and there's constant freezes that's the reason why there hasn't been any hardly any videos well minus not being able to have anything for PS4 but now I do so if anything a let's play for Xbox One, PS4 will begin at some point. Once I figure this out, I will have more videos of higher quality games. The GBA games and all that stuff may end up like once I'm done, I'm done, and then I'll start doing nothing but. So I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'll catch you on the next one where it's probably Mother 3, maybe. So see you later.